so this is the second second surface I'm grinding. It's probably the roughest surface on a Dennis Foster 18 inch hollow prism. So you see what I've got. I decided not to use a magnetic sign chuck, a compound magnetic sign chuck. I'm just using some V-blocks, magnetic V-blocks, and uh, I'm supporting it with planar gauges just for support. I set this up on a uh, granite table. And so this edge right here is the same on both ends. So that's what I'm qualifying this to. And uh, so I'm just gonna get started. I will uh, turn some cooling on here in a bit. So. So it's high right here, I know that. That's what I set up to. Right there. So I'm just gonna move my stop down. that is zero so I will let you know how much I take off take a couple fall down right here the video, turn some cooling on, and get started. So what I've got is I'm, I still got that high spot right there. So I've taken it down 15 thou, and now I'm hitting on both ends. I just started cleaning up on the far end. that cool Thank you. 
when I get it about cleaned up. So this is, uh, I'm taking 5,000 this pass, quite a bit for just holding it with a couple of bead blocks. But I do have, I have blocks on the back of that back of a V box I've got a back stop bar set up and uh, three planer gauges so and it is cleaning up the full length of it now and I did scrape that first side it took uh, I did a post about it it took four passes it was probably within a couple thousand being flat it took four, four scraping passes to get it completely flat. So. Alright, I'll show you this in a bit. So this is a 10 south rough and pass. gotten brave enough that I've just got it on one one thousand step over and I'm taking off six thousand pass right now. I'm just letting it step over by itself instead of uh, feeding it by hand. There's still a little tiny spot. I'll try and point it out with this finger I'm already missing. Right there. <laughs> Point it out with my stubby. This should be the last pass. I'll do a finish pass coming back this way. A couple of tents. So this is the finish pass. Taking uh, two tenths, maybe three tenths, stepping over one thousand, and stepping over each each pass, stepping over a thousand, stepping over a thousand. When I get this done, I will print it and show you the results of that. So here it is after it was printed. You can see where I just printed it on that table. Most of the times you can see that, the witness mark of where you print it. So it's pretty flat. Uh, it's within a tenth. 
you know it's got light spots right here in the middle that's it so that'll scrape in real nice and then I have this side left to do but I will not continue on because I gotta I gotta print this and scrape it today the guys coming over Sunday to pick this up so uh, I need to get started on that for the rest of the today and uh, but I will get back to this soon and uh, finish that side so thanks anyways Den thanks Dennis for the camelback for the 18 inch hollow prism and uh, there's 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 a name it's upside down but there you go he makes two different versions of this 18 I didn't realize that until today so anyways thanks for watching and uh, you know I'm not a grinder expert or a grinder hand but I try so learn from my mistakes. Thanks for watching.